Welcome to the Mileage Calculator tutorial for morecalculators.com. At morecalculators.com, we have over 20 different free calculators to help you with buying a car, buying a home, renting a home, estimating your taxes, making a budget, calculating your income, and investing in real estate. We invite you to try our calculators today at morecalculators.com. To get to the Mileage Calculator, Go to our home page and then scroll until you see the mileage calculator. Once you see the mileage calculator, go ahead and click on it. You'll see here is the mileage calculator. And basically it asks you four different questions. What we're going to do is we're going to go through three examples together. The mileage calculator calculates for the American metric and European measurement systems. The first example will be using the American measuring system. We're going, our example is going to be a trip from Cincinnati, Ohio to Tampa, Florida. The distance for that trip is 940 miles. The efficiency of our vehicle is going to be 19.8 miles per gallon which is basically the average for the United States vehicle fleet according to the 205 highway statistics, 2005 highway statistics from the U.S. Department of Transportation Federal Highway Division. Last but not least, we're going to put in our price per gallon, $3.65. The, there is a uh, question down here that asks you which measurement system would you like to use. The calculator defaults to the American measuring system. So if you live in the United States, then you do not need to change this at all. So now that we've got all of our entries in, we'll click on the submit button. Now the calculator will tell, tell us how much gas we will consume as well as how much it will cost. It says it is estimated that our 940 mile trip will consume 47.47 gallons of gasoline. It is estimated that the gasoline for your trip will cost a total of 173.28 cents or 18.43 cents per mile. We do not use any sort of currency symbol such as the dollar symbol or the cent symbol because our calculator is designed to be used anywhere in the world where there are other currencies. Our second calculation will be using the metric system, which is basically kilometers and liters. We've pre already pre-converted all of these uh, figures for the sake of time. We've determined that the distance of the trip is 1,513 kilometers. The efficiency of our vehicle is 8.4212 kilometers per liter and our price per liter is 1.06 and we're going to pretend that we're in Canada so in this case it would be 1.06 Canadian dollars which basically right now is the same as US dollar. Now. Since we're using the metric system, we need to tell the calculator we're using the metric system. So instead of American, we will put in metric. Just be sure to spell it correctly. And then finally, we'll click our submit button. It'll give us our answer here. It is estimated our 1513 kilometer trip will consume 179 liters of gasoline. It is estimated that the gasoline for your trip will cost a total of 190 and 45 cents or 12.59 cents per kilometer. So you can see that the gasoline is a little bit more expensive. Now, if we were to take the 179.67 liters, divide that by 3.78, which is how we get to gallons, we will find out that it's 47 gallons. So we know that our conversions were correct. Finally, 
The third measuring system is the European measuring system. This time we're going to pretend that we're in Germany. Now the kilometers remain the same, so we won't change that one. Now in Europe they use a different way to uh, measure efficiency of a vehicle. They're, they measure by liters per hundred kilometers. In other words, how many liters of fuel will it take for the vehicle to travel a hundred kilometers? For our example, we're still using the, a vehicle that gets 19.8 miles per gallon or 8.4212 kilometers per liter. Now, that means that our vehicle will take 11.8747 liters to travel 100 kilometers. And since we're in Germany, where gas is very expensive, it costs 1.477 euros per liter. That's according to the website B-E-N-Z-I-N-P-R-E-I-S dot D-E. We access that on the 2nd of August at 12.30 p.m. Mountain Time. Finally, the last question is the measuring system. We need to type in European. Now that we've entered all these questions, we'll click on Submit. And it says, it's estimated that our 1,513 kilometer trip will consume 179.66 liters of gasoline so that basically is the same it is estimated that the gasoline for your trip will cost a total of 265.36 or 17.54 cents per kilometer now remember we were measuring this in euros because that's the price that was quoted to us we could also do any other currency we could do yens or any other uh, currency such as uh, the pound and you will be able to calculate. Now, the conversion rate for euros to um, US dollars on the 2nd of August, according to Google, turns this 265 euros into $411.70. So basically, it's very expensive. Now, of course, in Europe, there's very few opportunities for you to travel 1513 kilometers so you do have to take that into consideration so basically that is the mileage calculator now if you have any questions or comments for us at morecalculators.com just visit the morecalculators.com homepage and then go to the morecalculators.com help center and there you'll be able to leave a comment or ask a question thank you and have a great day